Well, Vicki, this meeting started at 2 o'clock this afternoon. It immediately went into executive session and things were quiet in the beginning. But then after adjourning from executive session and coming back into the public, we talked, They there was a debate over the confidence that board members have in President James Ramsey. And tonight, the president is also weighing in. University of Louisville President James Ramsey was missing from the start of the Board of Trustees meeting. He joined nearly 45 minutes into executive session, but the meeting took a turn and ended up focusing on Ramsey. I also have serious concerns over a lack of transparency from administration in general, but in regard to this board specifically. Board member Jody Finally, Prather called for a vote of no confidence regarding President Ramsey. Current. Prather and a few other board members say they can't get their jobs done. Our work has in fact been made nearly impossible by a series of crises, either caused by or made worse by the current administration. Other board members disagree and say there was no place for the motion because this was a special meeting. Ramsey says it doesn't surprise him. I don't believe they... Um have put uh, the welfare of the university and students first. When asked if he plans on keeping his job, Ramsey word? replied, uh, I don't know. But then said he's not planning on resigning. When they do the next evaluation, we'll see. Trustee Emily Bingham says the public has been begging for something to be done. It has just gotten louder and more frequent and the pressures are are mounting. The voices are everywhere. Ramsey says what he heard at the meeting won't change the way he does his job. Uh, my focus has always been on um, the statutory mandate that we've been given by the people of Kentucky and that's to educate students and that's what we're doing the very best we can and uh, that's what my uh, focus will continue to be. One board member who says he had no idea the motion was going to be made uh, disagrees with the call broken. but says the board yeah, is broken. Saying, I think the governor should ask the entire board to resign. And I would resign it in that case because it's doing too much damage to the university. And since this was a special meeting and that motion was not on the agenda, that has now been pushed until the next meeting. That is when they will discuss this no confidence vote. That next meeting of the UofL Board of Trustees is April 20th. Reporting live, Carolyn Callahan, WLKY News.